Hey everyone. <laughs> I've seen this video going around where apparently the Makeup Revolution Concealer is better than Shape Tape by Tarte. And I'm like, honey. The minute I heard that, I was like, we need to investigate this. Is this for real? Now I use Shape Tape, ooh, hello. And I absolutely love it. It's like one of the best, if not the best. I find it hard to get my hands on in the UK. In fact, I find it almost impossible, which is why we had some family friends who actually live in New York come over and I asked them to buy it for me. That's how desperate I was. <laughs> you can get it on QVC, but it comes with a sponge which makes it more expensive or you can buy it on the Tarte website but then you'll be paying shipping and custom charge and all that kind of business. So if you're living under a rock and you don't know what shape tape is, this is the concealer of all concealers. But obviously some kind of like new little tiny concealers come in trying to mix it up you know trying to be like um <clears throat> how about me i'm four pound and i'm like the same this little bad boy i mean i haven't tried it yet it could be really really shit, but mm, i'm gonna have to beep that out because youtube won't let me otherwise <laughs> people keep saying this is better if not the same as the shape tape which i can't remember how much it is if i remember i'll ping it up here somewhere. This, by Makeup Revolution, is only four pound. I know, right? A lot of people are saying that the shade range isn't very good, but I bought mine online and they did have a pretty all right shade range. There was light and there was dark. There wasn't that many kind of neutrals. It was kind of a bit more yellowy, a bit more pink. But they did have ones for like repel people and they did cater for people that are of a darker skin tone as well. But again, I have not swatched them in person. I don't know if they're actually any good or not. I got C8. I'll bring you in a little bit more so you can actually see what I'm doing. Hi. We're gonna start with the Shape Tape because it's the one that I always use. I know what it's like and it's just easier that way. So that is how much product comes off. I'm gonna take it a little bit off of that because it's quite a lot. And we're gonna go straight in. I'm gonna really go for it today, maybe a bit more than I would usually, just because we're testing it out, so we we wanna know. You can already see, like, I mean, that's one swipe, and it's really, it's just it's so good. <laughs> a beauty blender I'm going to use to blend this out. It is damp, obviously. Please do not use this dry. And we're gonna just dab this right in. You can see, like, how amazing this is. Everything just looks so nice when I wear this. Like, it doesn't go right into my creases or anything. It just looks so beautiful. I'm gonna get right into here so you're not gonna see what I'm doing because I need to pull some weird faces for that. Now, we all know that Makeup Revolution is a copier, okay? Makeup Revolution is a photocopier. They like to copy everyone else and cash in on everyone else's business. So this is what it looks like, if you didn't know. It's pretty small when you compare the two together. 3.4 ml. Shape tape is 10 ml. So obviously you do get a lot more in this, but this is only four pounds, so it really doesn't matter, does it? Doe for applicator, it's big. It's, I don't think it's as big as the shape tape, but it's big. That's the two together. It's a little bit smaller, but it's still bigger than your average doe fat applicator, which I like. I like it. <laughs> One swipe. Pretty good. Again, it's not as big as the other one, so it's not going to put on as much, but consistency wise, it actually feels the same. It looks the same on the skin. My shape tape, by the way, is in the shade medium. So now I'm gonna blend it out and see if it's any good. Okay, that blends really well. <laughs> I'm lying, okay? I'm not doing this for the camera. It's actually so good. It's literally like shape tape. That is actually so good. I'm actually shook. <laughs> I got me a new concealer. It's actually really good. I wouldn't go as far as saying it's better. I, I can see 
that it is going in my lines a lot more than shape tape is. Um, meaning that shape tape is obviously better. I hope you can see what I mean. It's really gone into my crease lines a lot more than the shape tape has. But other than that, it's so nice. It's actually a really beautiful concealer, especially for British people. I know it's so difficult to get your hands on the shape tape, but if you can't get your hands on it and you want the next best thing, 100% get this concealer. I'm probably gonna have to use setting powder with this one because it is slightly separating. But I mean, generally you do have to do that with concealers anyway. It's just the shape tape's like extraordinary. You don't really have to. Um, I'm gonna zoom you out now. I don't think I actually mentioned the whole name of it. It's called Conceal and Define Full Coverage Conceal and Contour. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up if you did. If you want to see any more videos like this where I compare two different products that are supposed to be dupes of each other, if you have any products that you want me to do videos on that for, let me know. Anything else in the comments or on my Twitter. So, thank you for watching and I shall see you in my next video. Shook.